Your transmitter battery is good for up to three months. Starting at three weeks before the end of its battery life, the warnings count down the transmitter battery life until it has only 10 days, one sensor session left. If the transmitter battery has 10 days or less remaining, you won't be able to start a new session. You are prompted once the transmitter battery has died. At this point, you will need to replace your sensor and transmitter. To replace your Dexcom G6 transmitter, follow these steps. First, take the sensor off your body, then remove the transmitter from the holder. Second, enter a new sensor code. Third, enter a new transmitter serial number. Fourth, insert a new sensor and attach your new transmitter. Fifth, pair your new transmitter and start your new sensor. The system will guide you through these steps. The first thing you need to do is remove your sensor and transmitter. Grab the edge of the adhesive patch, peel the adhesive and the transmitter up and away from your body like a bandage. Next, you need to remove the transmitter from the holder. To remove the transmitter, push down the lip and break the wide end of the transmitter holder. Pull the transmitter out of the holder. Dispose of your transmitter. Next, you will need to enter a new sensor code. You'll need to enter a new sensor code because the code is specific to each sensor. Grab a new sensor and enter the code. Next, you need to enter your transmitter serial number. Find your new serial number on the back of the transmitter box. Enter your new serial number. Now you need to insert your sensor and attach your transmitter. Remember to insert the same sensor as the sensor code you just entered. First, wash and dry your hands. Choose a site to insert your sensor. Choose a site at least three inches away from your insulin pump infusion set or injection site. Avoid bony areas like ribs and hip bones and areas with scarring, tattoos, hair, or irritation. Also, you don't want to use the same sensor site two times in a row. Clean your skin with rubbing alcohol and let it dry. Remove both labels. Do not touch the adhesive. Place the applicator on your skin. Fold and break off the safety guard. Press the button to insert the sensor. Remove the applicator. You've successfully inserted your sensor. Now it's time to attach your transmitter. Clean your transmitter with an alcohol wipe and let it dry. Insert the transmitter tab into the slot. Snap the transmitter firmly into place. Rub around the patch three times. Now, back on your receiver, tap yes on the screen saying you have completed inserting your sensor and attaching your transmitter. Now it is time to pair your new transmitter and start your new sensor. Wait for your transmitter to pair and tap next on the pair successful screen. Tap the start sensor button. Now your two hour sensor warm up has begun. In two hours, you will start receiving your alarms and readings again. That's it. Now you know how to replace your Dexcom G6 transmitter. Of course, if you have any questions during setup or any other time, call Dexcom Technical Support or Dexcom Care.